Okay, hi everyone. I'm gonna start this Let's Play series with a very difficult game. Uh, I'm gonna start with Bloodborne, because why not? Uh, I'm gonna start online, so please, for the love of God, don't invade me and kill me straight away. I don't need that. <laughs> uh, I haven't played this for about five years, maybe? It came out nearly six years ago, so yeah, about five years. So, I'm gonna get a new game. I remember oh, yeah. nothing Pale. of this game. Literally nothing. So, <laughs> this will be exciting. <laughs> well, you've come to the right place. I will leave all the cutscenes in as well, Yana in case you haven't played it for some reason. You need only unravel its mystery. But where's an outsider like yourself to begin? Easy, with a bit of yarn and blood of your own. But first, you'll need a contract. So from what I remember, you're a hunter, and your contract is to hunt people, I guess. Um, okay, so, enter name. Sure. Uh, change in dinner will reset status. Yep, yeah, that's okay. Let's go for female. Why not? Let's go for an age female. Okay, so I've played a lot of Dark Souls, and I've played Demon Souls recently, um, and obviously I've played Bloodborne before. So depending on your build, the stats will obviously matter. Um, I don't remember any of the weapons. I don't remember what's necessary for certain weapons in this game. Um, so I'm just going to kind of go on what I can <laughs> vaguely remember from, let's say, Dark Souls, because that's going to be the most similar thing. Um, so usually it's skill or dexterity for Dark Souls for better weapon handling and weapon damage. Um, vitality is obviously health, endurance is stamina. Strength is raw power for heavier weapons. Um, that's kind of good, but vitality is not very high. That's not too bad, actually. Blood tinge, I think, is like not poison, but bleed effect. So I don't know if that's something I'm going to lean into. And arcane, I think, is like magic effects on certain weapons. So I don't think I'm going to lean into that either. Um, so usually I just go for something with high skill or dexterity, and I need some sort of vitality, so I think this one's a pretty good all round, so let's go with that. Appearance. Uh, it's not really going to matter to me too much, to be honest. Let's just go with default. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Change my gender, but that's fine. Okay. So. Let's begin. <clears throat> As I said, I haven't played this for about five years. <laughs> so, I have no memory of where to go. I only remember the first two bosses. The first one... Is that massive wolf thing and the second one is father gascoigne i believe there might be a like a sub boss before him but i honestly don't remember so this will be interesting and sealed now, it does look good though let's begin the transfusion. for nearly a six-year-old game oh, this does look really way. good whatever happens you may think it all a mere bad <laughs> okay so from what i remember i should wake up in this room and i have no weapons <clears throat> and i have to fight a wolf i think it's a wolf or a dog or something Oh god.
Guess I'm not fighting that then. Okay. Oh, I forgot about these little guys. They give me the kiss of life? What's going on? Ah, you found yourself a hunter. Here we go. Okay. So, okay, I guess square is heal, circle dodge, R1, R2, slow roll. Okay, time for nightmares, oh, absolutely. <clears throat> okay, let the so said nightmare begin. Let's go. I'm guessing sprint is hold circle. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Sounds. Here we go. All right. First guy. Oh, I've never actually killed this guy. Oh, I probably won't. But from what I was told when I first played it, you pretty much have to die to it. I think you can kill him, but I don't remember doing it in my first playthrough. Especially as I hadn't even played a Dark Souls game before this. So I wonder if I can actually uh, if I can actually kill him. Oh my god. I watch my stamina there, it's not very high. Okay, it's not going too bad. I seem to be doing okay, even though I'm only doing two damage. Oh! I spoke too soon. Oh! No! <laughs> Okay. Nearly had him. Nearly. That's the worst thing. Nearly had him. I did die. You're right. I know you're supposed to die to that first enemy, but it's still annoying when you get so close and then you die. <laughs> I think this brings me to my, to my safe place. Very nice. Okay, Hunter's Dream. I think, yeah, I get to choose my weapons. The messengers offered you a trick weapon. Choose one. Trick weapons are yielded, are wielded with the right hand. They're employed in beast hunting. Oh yeah, so... I'm pretty sure I used the Saw Cleaver last time. The Hunter Axe does more damage, but... It's got higher attribute requirements and the same scaling. Uh, it's got a plus nine bonus, so maybe that's better. But then that's a plus eight bonus on physical attack. Um, can I? Okay. So. If you guys haven't played uh, Dark Souls or Demon Souls or anything like that, um, your stats really matter, especially for certain weapons. So where it says attribute bonus and attribute requirement, you can see that it's got a D and an E next to the the arm and the hand. Uh, and obviously that represents strength and skill. So the attribute requirement means that I need eight 
strength and seven skill minimum to even use this weapon and then this one is nine strength and eight skill to use the weapon an attribute bonus um that is the scaling on how high your stat is so the higher your strength the better scaling you'll get but because it's a d scaling the scaling isn't going to be great same with um skill the scaling is going to be you're going to get some bonus but e is the worst so while that is good to have any kind of bonus it's also not great I've just noticed as well that the attribute bonus for the Hunter Axe requires Arcane as well. well. It doesn't require it, but the bonus I can get is through Arcane. But I'm not going to... I don't think I'm going to do an Arcane build, so I think it's best to just go with the Saw Cleaver. That's what I used on my first playthrough. Um, so I'll take that. And I get to pick a weapon. Well, a gun. So let's have a look. So I've got a pistol or a shotgun to choose from. Now, you don't get any shield in this. And <laughs> in Dark Souls and Demon Souls, I always use a shield. So that's why I found this game so hard. Because it's all about parrying. And I am not good at parrying. I've heard that the shotgun is better to parry with. But I've also heard that the timings to parry for either the pistol and the shotgun are the same. Which really doesn't help me. Attribute bonus and requirement is the same on both, so again, that does not help me. The pistol does more direct blood attack, but obviously the shotgun is a shotgun, so it have more range. Um, I, I honestly don't know what to go with. I think I went with a pistol last time. You know what? I think because I went with a pistol last time, I'm going to go for a shotgun this time. It's probably a huge mistake. But, I guess we'll find out. Um, I don't currently have them equipped, so... Let's equip that. And... Oh, that. Okay, so... L1... <clears throat> okay, so L1 changes it to be... My bigger, slower weapon. But it will do more damage. So, L2, yeah, L2 is to fire. There is a slight delay on that as well. Only slight, but I've just got to try and keep that in mind. And then what's this? A notebook received from the messengers. Leave messages with royal servants. Oh yeah, because obviously you can leave messages. Same in like Dark Souls or Demon Souls. You can leave messages to help. My dog is trying to climb all over me. Can I go in here? <laughs> Close. Okay. I believe this is the first world. Yeah, first world sick room. Okay. So, let's go back and try again. I mean, I have a weapon now, so I can't be struggling that much. But then, this is Bloodborne. Okay. Can I retrieve my soul? Blood echoes, sorry. I wonder if I can sneak up on him. There we go. Gotcha. Blood vial. Now I'm guessing that's to heal myself. Ah, okay. Restore HP as triangle. That's going to be confusing. Fear your blindness. It's the scourge of the moon. That does not help me at all. Two more blood vials. Okay. Wondrous hunter and treat courage with care. <laughs> Again, that does not help me in the slightest. <laughs> So, into Yarnum. I have no idea what to expect. Usually, 
usually when I'm playing Dark Souls I would hold a shield if I'm going around a corner or something because you never know what's going to hit you <laughs> all of a sudden. Uh, okay, that's close. <laughs> Not that way then. I can hear people up above me. Can I go this way? Yeah. Sometime today. There we go. Don't give up. That is very true. Alright, can't go that way. What's that in here? Anything? Nope. Ah, here we go. More blood vials. It's going to be confusing using triangle to heal because usually it's square. Uh, if... Ah, here we go. Alright! Oh, I've still got my weapon set to long range. Let's shrink that a little bit, I think. Okay, loads of blood vials. Pull this ladder down. Because I don't think I can go through here yet. I think I have to open this from the other side. Yeah, I think it's like here. And if I remember rightly, the shortcut to get this open is a complete nightmare. <laughs> so that'll be fun. Okay, can't go through there. Anything down here? Ah! A guy. Oh, there's another one. Oh, it's so much quicker using it like short range compared to up close. Um, it hasn't told me how to use a like a throwable item. I'm assuming I need to equip it. Get quick items. Um, but I don't know how to use that. Square? Yeah, okay. Okay, up the ladder. One thing you didn't... Well, I didn't know for ages, especially later on in the game, there's a really, really long ladder. Um, if you hold cycle while going up or down a ladder, it will speed you up. And that <laughs> was a nice scream. But yeah, if you're going down a really big ladder, you can hold circle and you can slide. So, if you didn't know that, that works across Dark Souls, Demon Souls and Bloodborne. Which is really helpful. Especially later on in the game when you have a very long ladder that takes about 30 seconds to get up. You know, remember prayer? I don't remember prayer. If I remember rightly, this is closed? Yeah. Oh wait. Okay. The lamp now transports you back to Hunter's Dream. Upon death you will awaken at this lamp. Okay. Well that's good. So that's my checkpoint. I forgot about those guys. Because obviously in Dark Souls you've got the bonfires. And then Demon Souls, you don't get any checkpoints unless you kill a boss, basically. Pebble. <clears throat> I think the pebbles are for distracting enemies. Okay. Let's try this shotgun out, because I haven't used it yet. Not very strong, but I guess for a weapon it doesn't need to be strong to parry. Okay. <laughs> that is a fine note. So I could drop down here, it is a little shortcut, um, but I think I'll go this way, it's probably the safest way. <laughs> I say safest and there's two enemies here. Come on. Okay. <laughs> that did not go to plan at all. But my health seems to be okay. Ah, hang on. Look, there's the lever over there. Lever, lever, whichever you want. I could wait for all these guys to pass and just kind of sneak through. If I just walk down, I don't think any of them will see me. Make sure no one's gonna sneak up on me. 
All right, <laughs> there's a big guy down there. Let's <laughs> get away from him. Uh, yeah, I don't think he's following me. Okay, so I don't really want to. <laughs> I don't really want to go this way because there's a big horde of people. Um, is it going to be easier to use a wider range weapon or go short range and be quicker? That is the question. That's a good point. What is going on in here? Are you that outsider? Well, sorry, but I don't want anything to do with you. Okay. Not along, will ya? <laughs> Rude. <clears throat> okay. Um. Well, let's. Oh, okay. Awesome. I feel like short range is not going to be my friend right now. Ah. Okay, wait. Okay, it's not too bad. Let's heal. I completely forgot about my shotgun. Oh. Okay. It's ah. not too bad. The parry is obviously really strong because you get a critical. Here. I can't remember what it's called on this. It's not critical hit, it's something else. But that was really strong, so let's uh let's try and do more of that. Quick silver bullets. Yeah, I'll take that, thank you. So your quick silver bullets are your bullets in your shotgun. Um <laughs> Do you not wanna get involved or Sorry mate, you can't you can't just sit there. You're in my way. What's up here? Ooh. And I am ah! Alright. Christ. Big Safo. Yeah, a bit late. God. Okay. <laughs> Just not ready for that at all. Okay. Oh wow, short range is really short range. Oh, I'll take that blood vial, thank you. I mean, that, there's a lot of them. Laura is effective. Yeah, I, I could use my pebbles that I picked up earlier um, to like lure them towards me, but what I might do is just go wide range. Ah. Oh! Okay. Shotgun is pretty effective. I think, anyway. I guess it depends on their attacks, because if I'm slow to attack... Ah! Alright, alright, alright. I'm sorry I killed your friends. Can you leave me alone? I love how everyone is pretty much cockney in this. <laughs> I mean, I don't live in London, but it definitely doesn't look like this. <laughs> Alright, can I sneak up on this guy without being killed by a hundred other people? And do critical attacks still work from behind? Doesn't look like it. <laughs> okay. Can I go through here? No? Okay. That did not sound good. Okay, so I can't go that way. Okay. I don't think I want to be down here. <laughs> Leave me alone, please. All right, all right, all right, wait, wait. Oh my god, <laughs> that was very close. <laughs> oh wow, okay. So the blood vial does basically nothing. Can I blow this up? 
I can't, but it does stagger him enough. And there's someone else shooting me. So I'm gonna have to... Uh, I didn't realise there was two! Ah. And a dog! Oh my god! I don't remember being this hard! <laughs> Welcome to Bloodborne! <laughs> Okay. Uh, I don't remember it being quite so difficult, but... <laughs> okay. Alright. The good thing is, we're back here, so I don't have to... go all the way back from the beginning. And I am going to use that shortcut this time. Oh yeah, go by this guy. Tires himself out by breaking the boxes, so that's fine with me. I will use your shortcut. Thank you. Oh. Sneak attack. Oh yeah, I'm back here. The person who doesn't want anything to do with me. Now, there's people down there. And there's people here. I've got to say... I know the game is based on, well not based, but I know you're supposed to get better at parrying. That's the whole point in like, the pistol and the shotgun and that's the design of the game. But <laughs> I miss having a shield already because <laughs> I don't want to go down that. I don't want to go this way. Oh my god, okay. I can take one at a time. The wide range is good, but it doesn't actually do that much more damage, so I don't know if that's actually helping me right now. i uh, beware of foe. Okay. Bit late, but thanks. So, yeah, I don't want to go that way. I must be able to get up here, surely. Is there no stairs to go? Okay. No. I mean, I wanted to go around to where that first person was shooting me. Like, up here. But, I don't... Oh, the stairs there, but... Um... Have they all just seen me? I mean, that's pretty effective, right? Okay. I mean, I'm happy with that. Ah! That guy's seen me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. That guy's still gonna shoot me. Okay. I get it. I'm just a simple hunter. Please leave me be. Alright, I'm going to run up here, because this guy is for sure going to kill me if the others don't. Okay. Ah, okay. Hang on a minute. <laughs> you were downstairs. You shouldn't have been able to hit me. Okay, the shotgun did nothing. <laughs> Alright. Um... Where is that dog? Oh, he's there. I, I hate fighting dogs, of all things. Okay, that one's pretty weak. I'm just gonna kill all of these guys, because the last thing I need right now is someone sneaking up ah! and attacking me. Okay. I can breathe. I mean, there's some guys up there, but I'm just going to leave them to it. Do I... Okay, do I open this? I mean, I don't really want to. Okay, I can't. Good. Where are they? Oh, they're just up there. That's fine. 
Now, I wonder if there's another checkpoint, because I have a lot of souls, or blood, or blood echoes, whatever it is, I have a lot of it. I think it's a lot. If it was Dark Souls, it would be a lot. <laughs> but I want to use them. I don't. I don't want to fight that guy. <laughs> but, but there's two items there. Should I? Maybe I should have a look for a save point first, and then come to him. Okay. Oh, there's another one! Ah! I thought you were dead! Okay. Ooh. I don't remember what that does. Oh, duh, obviously. Okay. Where is that laughing coming from? Is that in here? What is so funny? I don't reckon you're from round here. Well, stuck outside on a night of the hunt. Oh, you poor, poor thing. <laughs> I mean, you could let me in. <laughs> okay, rude. <laughs> All right. Oh, is that an item? Yes. I don't know what it does, but I'm going to take it. And you know what? I'm going to fight this guy. With Molotovs. Okay, that was... Ah! <laughs> How are you not dead? Oh my god. <laughs> How did I not die then? And how did he not die? Ugh. <sighs> Shining coins, was that even worth it? I don't even know what that does. A torch. More Molotovs. And I can't even open that door. Okay. Alright, I guess it's this way then. Ah. Something is chasing me. No? Okay. Can I open this gate from this side? Why? I can hear someone. Can I go this way? Closed. Okay, no one to laugh at me through there. Oh, a dog. Two dogs. This is why I hate fighting dogs. They're so quick. Oh. No. <laughs> no. Wait. No. That's heal. Leave me alone, dog. How did I not get hit then? Oh my god, that was lucky. Okay. You're welcome? Uh, I guess up here. I feel like I recognise that. No, 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 no. What's this way? <laughs> If I remember rightly, there is a shortcut. Ah. Uh, a shortcut back, but not a shortcut to here. That's not what I was expecting, to be honest. Well, looks like I'm going to have to fight those dogs. 
really don't want to, but I don't think I've got a choice. Have I? Doesn't look like it. Oh wait, what's this? Okay. I just noticed I am covered in blood. There is a shortcut along here, I'm sure there is, but I'm guessing I have to... God damn it, not heal myself all the time. Alright, not gonna make the same mistake as last time. You can take three. Ah, uh, okay. That was a bit of a mistake. Okay, so fire worked very well. Oh. Okay, well that wasn't too bad. I'll tell that. Is there a shortcut along here? Ah! There's someone else. There's a big guy. What's this? Oh my god, it's dark in here. Ah. Oh, okay. You're not dead? <sighs> right. Another one? This doesn't look like a shortcut. Oh my god. <sighs> Scared the hell out of me. What's this? Okay. Right. So can I go through here? Yes. Where does this take me? I hear a person. Ah, uh, alright. Where am I? I'm feeling very nervous now. <laughs> ah! I knew there was a shortcut. I knew it. Okay. Alright. <laughs> that was an intense start to Bloodborne. Um, I think <laughs> I'm going to leave it here for now. Um, I will definitely carry on doing this <laughs> until I... Well, either until I finish it or until I give up out of... <laughs> pure rage <laughs> um, but yeah if you watched to the end thank you um, obviously no worries if you didn't but then if you didn't you wouldn't hear me saying bye so I will do a part two and I will carry on because I think there's a boss about to come up as well so thank you guys and I guess tune in next time for <laughs> more of me dying and screaming <laughs> bye